Trichicon's Aaron Adkins is here to show us the ropes. These are all, you know, very simple uh, to operate, very simple to, to zero. I mean, they zero the same way you would a day scope. Okay. So you know, you're looking at a screen, but you got a reticle on the screen. And mm -hmm. so you're basically just chasing your impacts down range. So if you're shooting high right, you just move your reticle up and right. These two optics that I brought, they're both 35 millimeter, which is the focal length of the objective lens. So that kind of determines your system magnification. Uh, the 35 was kind of like a medium level magnification for, okay. for what we're going to be doing, shooting hogs uh, in this yeah. kind of terrain here in South Georgia. It should work really well. You can do a digital zoom for your first shot and then kind of back out mm -hmm. for follow-up shots when the hogs start moving around. So okay. it's, let's mount one up and see. Alrighty, so yeah, the, like. this uh, this repire comes with a really slick little D-lock mount, so I mean, you literally just pop it on the rail, it holds itself on there, and then you just thumb screw it down. That's it? That's it, that's all there is to the D-lock right there, that's and that's, cool right that's there. ready to rock. So, you know, some general tips, once you mount it on your rifle, you need temperature contrast downrange in order to zero against. So what seems to work pretty well is just a white background with a black shoot and see against it. And if the sun's behind you, that's really gonna show up well. Okay. Uh, steel works great pretty much all the time. You know, even a bottle of water, if you have something like yeah. that, that's good. you just need temperature contrast. Okay. So just remember these don't see light, they see heat. I think we're uh, pretty much ready to that shoot all of it. Sounds good, yeah, let's do it. <laughs> 